As you already know, based on the title of this video, I am no longer in Argentina. In fact, by the time you see this video, I'll be ready to board a plane and head to Mexico. You might be a little confused if you follow me on here or on Instagram, because pretty much everything I've been posting is still about Argentina. I actually left three months ago. When I moved to Argentina last year, I thought I was moving to my potential forever home. So why did I leave? Well, the answer is a little bit complicated, a little bit emotional. So this video will be a little bit different from most of my other videos. If you are not new to my channel, then you already know I spent all of the last year in Argentina seeing as much as I could from north to south and everything in between. I even wrote a love letter to Buenos Aires. I want to talk to you about what led me to this place where I felt I needed to leave, as well as the future of this travel channel. I've been living outside of my home country for the majority of the past 20 years. These experiences have been amazing, but at the same time, it has left me feeling like I have more branches than roots, that my quest for ultimate freedom has very often led me to ultimate loneliness. But I also can't deny that feeling deep down inside of me that is constantly looking for and needing adventure. Over the past couple years, I've really been craving a home. A place I can come back to after a trip, where I have consistent friendships and weekend plans. I want community. So I started thinking of the places where that could be, where I felt I might belong. The places I have already been and loved, for me, that place was Argentina. So last January, I packed my bags and headed south with the hope of Argentina being that home that I craved. The first several months in Argentina kept showing me I had made the right decision. Everything felt right. I was making friends. I felt so connected. Of course, not everything was perfect, and I definitely had my frustrations. Like so much dog shit on the sidewalk. Like the annoyance of dealing with Argentina's money situation. It's frustrating because I already went to two different Western unions four different times and they don't have money. Once I even had to go to eight different Western unions in one day. Like constantly being asked if Americans eat hamburgers every day. Or if I had been to the Grand Canyon because I'm from Colorado. The Grand Canyon is in Arizona or even having entire conversations in Spanish. And then when they ask where I'm from and I say the US, they ask me in Spanish if I speak Spanish after we've been speaking Spanish for 10 minutes. And while those things are annoying, no place is perfect. You can find annoying things about any country you visit, including my own. They certainly aren't enough to make me want to leave. I still love Argentina very much. Halfway through the year, I met someone and I started to feel that everything was falling into place. All the things I wanted were happening. The relationship moved very quickly and we moved together to Buenos Aires. Unfortunately, pretty quickly, I started to realize that while we were aligned on so many of our values and we wanted the same things, we were just not as compatible as I had originally thought. Our relationship began to deteriorate and I started to feel very misunderstood and alone. Alone in a country, a culture, and a language that was not my own. I was losing confidence with speaking Spanish, with expressing myself in Spanish, with moving around the city. I started waking up every morning with anxiety. And then my phone got stolen from my hands as I was using it in the middle of the day. I had already been feeling very vulnerable before this, and so the trauma of the situation was really compounded. I started to feel uncomfortable in the city, paranoid. Buenos Aires started to feel loud and ugly and dirty. The anxiety got worse and the relationship got worse until it finally ended. I started having really circular conversations with myself, like if we're not together, do I stay in Buenos Aires? If not Buenos Aires, do I stay in Argentina? If Argentina, where? If not Argentina, also where? Where? Where in this world do I belong? I left Buenos Aires for a month to be in nature, 
to process and to try and clear out all the fog that had covered my brain for the past several months, to heal, to figure out what I needed. What I realized pretty quickly was that I needed support and I just didn't have that kind of support system in Argentina. I wanted and needed to be around people who love me and who know me. I wanted to express myself in my native language. I had only been in Argentina for one year, and I had bounced around a lot within the country, so I didn't have a solid community anywhere. It was a really hard decision to make, to leave the country I hoped would be my home. But ultimately, the decision that I needed to make in that moment was the one that supported my mental health. I've now been in the United States for the past three months, visiting my lifelong friends in Baltimore, Dubuque, San Francisco, and Seattle. I've spent nearly every day with my family, including my two new nieces. I may not have a physical home, but my people are my home, and they are exactly what I needed these past several months. I'm finally feeling clear-headed, I'm feeling happy, and I'm ready to continue with my next adventure. I've left Argentina for now, but it doesn't mean I'll be away forever. I love Argentina, so this is just hasta luego and not goodbye. I'm so grateful to Argentina for the past year, and of course, most grateful for all the people. Those who watched my videos and left kind comments, those who have been so encouraging, those who have purchased my book and my city guides, I really appreciate you. And while I won't be creating any more Argentina videos for a bit, I do hope that you'll follow along as I head to Mexico, Puerto Rico, and wherever else life and YouTube takes me. But for now, if you're looking for more videos about Argentina, just click on this playlist right here. Why not?